Hey loves, so I know that I get a lot of questions about how it is that I fix my pixie. Um, so today I am going to make sure to answer all of those questions for you while putting together this little uh, pixie tutorial on how I do my down styled pixie. I know that y'all have also seen that sometimes I style it up, but today we are going to look at how I do this type of pixie. Very simple, very easy. Please do not forget to like and subscribe and I hope that you enjoy. Okay, so first and foremost, we have to make sure that our hair is brushed out. And what I like to do, I like to kind of brush my hair forward and then I'll brush my bangs a little bit to the side just to go ahead and prepare it for being formed. And this is about two day old hair. So I haven't washed it in a couple of days. Of course, I take showers and I wash my body, but I don't wash my hair daily um, just so that I can maintain texture. So now that it is all good and brushed out, we're gonna start with the styling process. Okay, so I get a lot of questions about the product that I use in my hair, and um, I use a couple of different products. First and foremost, I use Freeze It Hairspray. This is the hairspray of all hairspray so far that I have found. You can find it at your local drugstore. I buy mine from Walmart. It's great, it's six bucks, and it holds like crazy. Another product that I have been using lately since I process my hair a lot is the, the Main Choice Ancient Egyptian Split-In Treatment Serum. This stuff is really great if you have a short haircut, get it cut often, uh, process it a lot. It really helps maintain any split-ins that I do have so I can go a little bit longer between cuts. first thing that I'm going to do is just apply a little bit of the split in serum I definitely like to do this when my hair is a little bit dirty I'm not gonna apply much just gonna put a little bit right there on my fingers and then I'm gonna use the tips of my fingers just to kind of apply it to the very ends of my hair and like I said this is really great for if you are consistently processing your hair um, we definitely want to make sure to keep your hair healthy. As you can see, I have extremely thick hair, um, but if I'm not careful, it, you know, I, I will get some fallout, which is really gross. Nobody wants to deal with that. And now to my favorite part, we are going to go into the styling. This is a really simple, really easy uh, procedure. Again, just kind of make sure that your hair is brushed forward and then just kind of go in with your fingers and start playing with it. Um, if you do have um, like a couple of day old, not washed hair, you'll find that it's going to be a lot easier to play with and to kind of mess around with. You can definitely do this with washed hair too though. Um, it, you just have to use a little bit more product to kind of add that texture, but I really enjoy that about my hairspray. So we're just gonna kind of go in and kind of start forming the pixie style with my fingers, kind of getting it together. And then what we are going to do is we're going to use some hairspray, and if you have watched any of my pixie tutorials in the past, or if you know me personally, you know that I do not go light on the hairspray. I love hairspray. So as you can see, I'm just kind of picking up the edges of my hair while I spray it. Lots of hairspray. I promise you it's because I'm Southern. I think that it is a Southern requirement to use a ton of hairspray. Um, I also know a lot of people don't like aerosol sprays, but for me personally, they just hold my hair better. Um, as you can see, I have a lot of hair. So aerosol is definitely my go-to. So we're just gonna spray it one more time really good, make sure that the back is good. Thank you. 
And there you have it, a really simple, really easy pixie tutorial. Um, like I said, this is how I style it when I wear it down and I kind of want it to be a little bit more fun. Um, again, please do not forget to like and subscribe. I will also make sure that I list the products that I used in this video below. And I hope that y'all have a wonderful and blessed day.